Hey guys, so I decided to show you the Halloween Easter egg and other Halloween related things on CT. So as for the Easter egg, if you jump into the bomber and jump back out, you get transformed into some kind of Halloween demon soldier. As you can see, your screen will start going in between different color filters, which kind of tripped me out at first. And you have the amazing ability to jump really high, as you can see, and your run speed is increased as well. Also, if you see other players using this power-up, you'll notice their heads are on fire and leave a really cool fire trail as they move around. And no, you can't shoot while doing these crazy jumps. You do need to be on the ground. I was in a 1v1 fight session with a couple of players, which is coming up pretty soon. We were trying to kill each other with the Easter egg affecting our soldier, and I felt like I was playing Quake with all the jumping and trying to guess where the enemy player was going to land, which was pretty fun. So as you can see, Pearl Market is a nighttime map for the Halloween event, which is really cool. The darkness creates a nice atmosphere and a more intense gameplay experience. And there's a few Halloween decorations and whatnot around the map, like this pumpkin head that explodes if you shoot it. And if you walk down a few of the alleyways, you'll see bats fly out and there's a battlefield ghost that pops up. This one showed up when I was walking up the stairs and to be honest, it kind of scared me a bit. I wasn't expecting it, but I do believe the ghosts show up on any map on the CTE client. So in terms of actual CTE updates, there's a lot of new features and fixes, which I'll make a video about soon. So expect it in the coming days, but I will mention a couple of things. Console players that want to participate on CTE, if you own premium on your console and you also own a PC, then you're able to sign up for CTE on your PC, which is really good news. And there's a massive fix to head glitching, which I was testing out before. And it does help fix the issue of head glitches, but it still needs a lot of work, which is to be expected anyway, seen as it's still in a prototype phase. But anyway, guys, I just thought I'll make a quick video showing you the Halloween event in CTE. Hope you guys enjoyed the footage and I'll see you in the next video.